What's going on everyone? I'm Rico Men and welcome back to my channel. And today's conversation is going to be about HD Retrovision and their recent announcement. If you've watched my channel, you know recently I did a video called 2018 is the year of Sega and this is just a continuation of that topic. So HD Retrovision just recently demoed on their Twitter page a component cable for the Sega Dreamcast which is great because that's probably the best image quality you're going to get on most modern TVs. Originally when the Dreamcast was released it came with composite cables which gave you like the worst video quality that you could imagine. You really didn't want to deal with composite video cables if you didn't have to. Most people at the time were, had uh, S, -video, uh, S video ports on their TVs, mostly CRTs most likely. And people like myself bought the VJ adapter as soon as the Dreamcast was released which was the best possible video quality that you could possibly get on the console. Unfortunately, these days, when you get, when you get these modern TVs now, the modern, pla uh, well, not plasmas, no, they don't even make those anymore. But when you get modern TVs, you know, in 4K TVs and LED TVs and, you know, any, any, any modern HD TV, what you'll see is that there's a lack of S-Video ports that's pretty much, it is dead. You don't see S-Video anymore. And I haven't seen a VGA port on a TV in a very, very long time. So, your best bet it's probably going to be either HDMI, which every TV comes with HDMI now, and most still come with component cables, although those are slowly being phased out as well, but at least it's an option if you need to buy a TV now. So the HD Retrovision solution will allow you to play your Dreamcast on your modern TV through component cables in a simple and precise manner. Now I can say that with full confidence because I own most of their products. And I'm very happy with what they provide. Stand for you. It's their Saturn, it's their, not Saturn, um, their Genesis cables. And I do have the Saturn adapter for them. But the cables are very high quality and, you know, nice thick shielded cables. And they eliminate a lot of things like audio buzz. You know, they give you proper colors, uh, nice white balance and all that good stuff. So it's definitely worth getting these over something like this, uh, like for example, this retro bit. Uh, VGA box when you when you look at these these are fairly cheap and they do work I mean obviously you're going to get better video quality out of this than a, than a regular composite cable you know the yellow white and red cables you're going to get better quality out of this over that if your TV has a VGA port now the other issue with these boxes is if you don't have a VGA port you're going to get one of these and they have a to hook it up to one of these which is a VGA HDMI adapter and what happens is I mean look look at all this wiring and this is not even everything you have to hook, hook up a VGA cable between these and, and patch an audio line before you know it, you have a whole spider web of cables behind your TV for one console so I'm looking forward to the HD retrovision solution because not only will I do I know that they'll get it right they're, they're very picky about <laughs> releasing a product that's not very close to perfection which I appreciate especially when I'm spending money on a product but you also save space and as well as time with not having a rat's nest spider web of cables based on these type of things. So I'm very excited about the product. I'm curious to see uh, what they'll do with it, how much it will cost, and how it'll compare to other options. I mean, these even though I mentioned this, there's another option. There's uh, the Behar Brothers boxes, which are great. For example, um, you can take those. You know, those boxes are very high quality. They also don't have any audio buzz. But if you, there's certain games that use S video or don't use the VGA mode that can be kind of tricky to work with those to, with those boxes if you don't have the right inputs either. So you may want to wait for these cables and see how they, how they work out. Supposedly, uh, from H, what HD Retrovision is saying is that there'll be a toggle on the actual cable, the component cable itself, to allow you to play, you know, the old games like King of Fighters '99 Dream Match that don't have VG, a VGA mode. Now, I can't wait to try that out. You know, even though there's other ways to play King of Fighters, the Dreamcast version has its own, I guess you could say, unique trait in the fact that it has the 3D backgrounds and things like that. But it's something I'm looking forward to. So I'm really curious to see what they do with the cable. And hopefully it'll be, you know, priced right and come out soon enough. Hopefully they'll make enough for everybody. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you thumbs up, rate, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Take care.